Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. We are officially two weeks into Natland. I hope you all had a chance to go out there and explore and also play the Archon Quest because I did the first half. However, I went ahead and saved the second half so that people had more time so I could play it on stream for all y'all. And today is the day because after this video, you're going to see me live tonight playing the second half of the Archon Quest, where I'm sure we're going to see Capitano. I mean, come on, he's going to be there. You know what I mean? Anyways, my friends, we are here to do our good old react to some trailers because being in 5.0 we have a whole new set of characters to look through we got teasers and trailers out the gate and we're gonna be looking at mulani's stuff right here so leave a like and subscribe and let's dive right into mulani's teaser kindness begets friendship this should be interesting being a guide in that land isn't easy you never know what can happen on an unfamiliar road. All right, all right. Great to Stop hear Cassandra right Lee Morris. Oh my god, everyone was simping over this NPC when this came out like a week ago. Or really two weeks ago. Came out before Natland. Still, as the elders say, if you can solve a problem with Mora, might as well take the easy road. What, are you gonna bribe her? Oh my god, she kicked her. You're new with this, aren't you? First robbery? Oh. Oh. Why did you do that for her? This is for you. Not because you tried to take it, but because you're about to do me a favor. What? <laughs> hey, yo. <laughs> oh, Reverse robbery. It, what is this? Could you take us somewhere? Okay. Oh. Whoa, All right. You're the tour guide now. It's really here. Oh, what are you looking for? A flower? I'm sorry. I wouldn't have done this if there was any other way. Shh. Come with me. Go to the Adventurers Guild. I mean, I think the job kind of sucks, but you know. <laughs> Looking for a landscape. Rafts, baby. Bro, you can get crushed by these things in that land. It's great. <laughs> Today was awesome. You're not a bad person after all. Not anymore. Oh. Uh, she talked her out. Being a guide sounds like she a is part cool of the job. um with her clothing she's part of the water tribe technically but i guess it doesn't matter if you're part of the tribe you can still resort to criminal yeah the elders also say beautiful scenery and good friends are wow look at that good. that's really pretty <laughs> guess i hit the jackpot that'd be kind of scary though it's like someone tries to mug you and then it's just like yeah we're gonna like sleep under the same tent you know it's like not scary at all there is also um this trailer by the way i'm not gonna watch it's just it's a cool it's a cool animation i'm just gonna leave it be it probably looks cool uh etc but that was nice okay uh <laughs> dude mulani just stuck her face in there she's like yo robbie look at him fly bro <laughs> was she like kick it <laughs> that's You're funny honestly i like i talked about this in the stream that we uh you know of course the first part of the archon quest you're gonna have uh the characters who are gonna be on banner right and she's very involved in that segment it was really cool uh because i ended up growing uh on mulani a lot as a character uh you know her personality because i don't really like her gameplay or uh you know that kind of style of gameplay it has the right ideas but it's missing certain pieces uh that really make it click for me and also i mean cassandra Lee more morris's voice is awesome but it's just it's too bad the gameplay can't lock with me but personality wise really enjoying it and you know this is, this is a cute this is a cute little teaser i would say nothing too out of the park for teasers i will say teasers you know they only have so much time to really convey uh what they have to do you know literally like two to three minutes uh you know this one's quick short and sweet nothing super deep uh you know and that's okay i'm sure we'll get the deep characters later but let's move on to the demo and i'm very excited to see the demo itself because every time we move into a new region especially now uh, we have a lot more high quality demos and hopefully this continues because I talked about it in the Clorend reaction that we did is that they updated the engine around that time. You could tell the difference uh, in the lighting and what they were doing with the animation. So let's go ahead and see what they got for us over in Mulani. The ultimate sightseeing experience, her demo, baby. Still capped at two minutes. I really wish they extended it, but you know. All right, looking good already. Oh, the music. That's right, baby. I forgot about that. Oh, that's cool. I didn't notice. Uh, I don't, Does she do that in game? Uh, her tattoos light up. Okay, that's cool. Oh. Oh, my goodness. Whoa. A cute demo. It's already really vibey. 
I think it is showcase or gameplay, I wonder. There we go. Oh, okay. Boom, boom, boom. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is something I did see. Uh, <laughs> Spider-Man catching Gwen. No way. Oh yeah, I, I saw this uh, too from someone's picture. Uh, that there's actually is a skate park, and I wonder if it works. Oh, she gonna do like her burst or something? My uh, animation quality is very high. Definitely want to look at uh, specific parts. Okay, music slowing down. Put on puffer mission people. Oh yes, one of the best attack animations they have in the game. Really up their game on that. One. All right, last but not least, it's time for oh, she's in the floaty. Ready? I can't believe that's her plunge attack. So goofy. I'm, I know that once this song finally comes out, I'm going to be putting this on my playlist immediately. It's so good. It's like summer fun, you know? They honestly, they, they really did release her at the best time, like right at the tail end of summer before it goes away, you know? And there she goes on the Velocigen Road. Did you have fun? Of course you did. Catch you on the next one. Oh, that was cute. Yeah, no, it was fun. Definitely uh, just a four fun trailer through and through it. I mean, that's what, you know, the first character of, you know, the region should definitely do. I don't know if Linny's necessarily match that or Tagnari's. I mean, I guess I would say they all really do keep it based within the region. You know, there's no uh, maximum intensity, right? You know, they're just doing uh, the stuff, trying to get the vibe. And also, you know, of course, portraying their character. But Mulani really does represent uh you know the whole fun aspect of natlin because i mean that's definitely the direction they took with it especially with the gameplay design is just making the thing super duper fun so there isn't much necessarily to talk about right i just will say though like you can tell like the difference in uh, like animation quality uh from previous demos because i did you know i didn't watch emily's but i had to see it uh when i was doing tcg casting is that they had it playing uh so i saw it in the corner of my eye basically all the time uh and that one was mostly fully animated this one you know, they did a lot of good camera work, and there is a good amount of animation segment. I definitely want to highlight a uh, certain section, though. This one right here, you know, just playing playing the game normally. Pops out of the picture, got a 2D transition into this one. My goodness. And then freaking, he catches her. It's great. Like, this is beautiful. Look at this. The depth of field that they're able to get in this, unlike their uh, standard conventional animation practices and the approaches they usually take towards uh these demos is not something you can get uh in a shot like this like this is incredible like you know of course it's the uh people of the forest you know people of the canopies you know they got this really tall region but look at this look how far down it goes it's incredible the scale that you can find here yeah, and then here we go we have the skate park and then a transition boom immediately back into gameplay you can actually do this uh, and I want to try this, of course, with Kachina, probably, because uh, I don't have Mulan. I already talked about we're not pulling for her. Anyways, I don't know. I Maybe I will be convinced. I don't know. Probably not. But, yeah, once again, yeah, just a, lot, a lot of expression. Oh, poke. <laughs> Honestly, it's, I don't know. She, she's such a good character. I can't wait to see her in the Archon Quest, because, you know, that's the next segment that I'm on. This is the Mon Part 2. That's where we're at right now. This one right here. Yeah, see, you look at that. Uh, that's kind of a signature of Mulani. But this is the thing that I always talked about is that they should definitely get crazier, uh, you know, with the style of animation that they do. Yeah, so this is... um, I can't remember the specific animation principle, right? But, you know, they're making it look like your arms are moving so fast. But, you know, literally, uh, that doesn't actually work in the 3D model, right? But, you know, they're adding these 2D effects, you know, very similar uh to taking animation principles from zenless zone zero i'm not gonna call it squash and stretch uh because that is incorrect genshin characters do not squash and stretch in fact uh they do not do that but uh it is one of her things that she does in her attack animation and now they put it in the trailer and it just it looks so good because they're finally getting a lot more creative uh with their animation this looks amazing look at all these frames uh that they drew out with these 2d effects and this is like you know specific too and it's really awesome it's really cool that they even added it in the game in the first place like here we go let's just see that and the lighting on you know her night soul too is amazing you get the npcs doing their thing bang super duper nice man i'm just gonna let i'm gonna let it fly until we hit that burst baby there it is again bang using a lot of these uh photo effects they've done this 
dozens of times before, but like now they've really improved the animation. Whoa! God, this is amazing. What a good trailer. What a good stuff, honestly. All right, though, I will leave it there. You know, quick, quick, and quick and dirty reaction over with you. Not too much to say, but you know, just in general, looks really nice and pretty. I really hope uh, this trend continues into uh you know other characters and more importantly especially the ones that matter you know when they start going back to the dark trailers uh especially arlecchino arlecchino has risen up to be probably one of my favorite trailers out there but yeah that's gonna do it for the reaction today so here we are uh again one more time we are streaming the natlan archon quest tonight so be there it's gonna be a little later than usual uh you know i've been doing kind of a nighttime stream schedule i'll try to be you know a little more friendly uh you know towards uh certain regions but you know it is gonna be the time that i feel the most comfortable but yeah just be ready for that and of course in general just check out all the other content that we have we just finished up a lot of withering waste that we did three days stream uh tons of stuff so yeah check out all that tcg you got to do all that stuff too but yeah thank you all so much for watching of course and now that we're finally in a new region it's only appropriate that we have a new outro hit it baby oh,